So can I buy you a beer? Yes. Okay. I actually, I wrote a prediction down about what beer I was gonna order you. Really? But I thought that we could get you involved and we'll try to find a random way. Okay. So, and we have, uh, let's see, where's the beer on the menu? Here it is, so there's about maybe 15 different beers. Okay. And here's how we're gonna do it. I need you to think of a number in your head. Don't tell me what it is. Okay. Between, we'll say one and 15. All right. You got one? Mm-hmm. All right, now I want you to multiply it times two. So just double the number. Okay. You have it in your head already? Yeah. Okay, now add eight. You okay. can use your fingers under the table if you want. Okay. Sorry, <laughs> Sometimes I do. All right, good, all right. And uh, now I want you to divide your number in half or just, you know, divide it by two, cut it in half. Okay. You have it? Mm -hmm. Now I want you to subtract whatever your original number was. You remember what that was? Yeah. So subtract that from the number you have now. Okay. You got it? Yeah. Hopefully we're at a, at a random number. Is your number right now lower than 15? Yes. Good, okay. So whatever number you're thinking, I want you to look at the bottled beer list. Okay. And uh, say it's the se say you're thinking of the number seven, go down and look at the seventh beer. Whatever, whatever number you're thinking, find the beer that corresponds. Got it. You have one? Yep. Which beer are you going to order? Blue Point Toasted Log. Look at it! And that's my prediction. Blue Point Toasted Lager. Two blue points, please. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, how does that work? How did you All right, know? well, while we're waiting for the beer, I'll yeah. explain how it works. Uh, it's a math trick, and actually it's a way to always make the number equal four. Okay. And if you look here on the menu, blue point toasted lager was the fourth four. one down. Uh, but And I'll teach you in a moment how you can actually change it to any number that you'd like. Mm -hmm. uh, so if you know somebody's favorite beer, uh, you can you can force Dude, that, exactly. Down. So here's the first step is, and it all works by itself. You have someone pick a number between one and 15 or one and 10. I always like to keep the number somewhat low. Mm -hmm. That way you lower the chances of them messing up the math. Okay. Uh, so you have someone think of a number between one and 10, and then you tell them to multiply it times two or double it. Mm -hmm. And the next step is to add eight. Okay. The next step is to divide it by two. Okay. And the next step is to subtract the original number. Okay. So pick a number, Multiply times two, add eight, divide it by two, subtract the original number. Subtract the original number. Exactly, and okay. that always equals four. Great. You know, whether you pick one or great. one million, always equals four. Okay. Um, and the reason is because you're adding on that number eight, and then you're cutting it in half. Okay. Exactly. So, and then you have them go down, and then you make sure that your prediction ahead of time matches the fourth one down on the menu. Okay. Uh, now there's a couple ways to change the math. Uh, so for example, if I wanted, uh, let's see, if I wanted the Cooper's Pale Ale, mm -hmm. that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven down. Mm -hmm. Pick a number between one and 10, mm -hmm. multiply it times two, add eight, divide it by two, subtract your original number, add three. Add three. Because so you know just, four right, plus three. You'll always know it's four. Exactly. There. And there you go. Or the other thing is if, you, if you're using an even number, where I said add eight mm -hmm. and you get four. If I wanted to go for five, the fifth one down, I say add 10 mm -hmm. and divide it by two. But that's getting a little complicated. The best way is just to add a number at the end. This is great. Wait Isn't that I, great? Wait till I use this on Courtney. Oh yeah? <laughs> <laughs> I'll have to buy Courtney a drink now. <laughs> and that's how you predict somebody's drink.